A day meant to celebrate the work Nevada football put in this offseason. Instead, injuries, making head coach Jeff Choate ask himself if spring games should even exist. During the red zone competition portion of the silver and blue game, last year's starting running back Sean Dollars got injured on this play. It got stood up a little bit, and I think probably when it, when it hit the ground, I would suspect more than the initial contact. Dollars laying on the ground for quite some time as the team's medical staff checked on him. The rest of the team taking a knee as Dollars got strapped to a spine board, put on a stretcher, and then wheeled out of Mackey Stadium. Good news is, you know, he had feeling in, in his extremities, everything was moving, but, you know, I'm not going to predict anything on the diagnosis, just... Yeah, again, kind of a kind of a bummer, obviously, and, and we just want to make sure that he's okay. The very first play of the spring game was not kind to Nevada either. Last year's leading receiver, Dale Von Campbell, tracking down a deep ball and coming up holding his right hamstring. They Burles in the second, also missed time with a wrist injury. But there were other healthy members, and Choate was proud of his offense. Former Bishop Minogue wide receiver Marshawn Brown really shined at receiver. He's a freak physically and athletically, and, and he's just got the, the reps. Why Choate opted to have a spring game in the first place? Well, it gives him and his staff a chance to evaluate their team in a more competitive atmosphere. Lack of discipline stood out today, however. Their anxiety levels go up to the point where they have unforced errors. They don't they don't play within the scheme. They, they The moment becomes bigger than they can handle, and so that's what you're really looking for. Players were not available for comment after the game. Up next, fall camp beginning July 24th. In Reno, Kurt Schroeder, Coldaway Sports.